back to another vlog so it is sunday afternoon it's actually like three o'clock i'm off to a very late start um but today's video is pretty much going to be like a sunday reset so i need to um like go get groceries um do laundry and then i'm finally gonna be unboxing all the stuff that's like been in the corner for literally like a month now so it's just like new bedding and stuff so i don't think i'm gonna like do an actual unboxing because i want to hurry up and put everything in a washer so that i could go ahead and like do the bedding makeover for you all so you will see like the before and after um but yeah i just got like new sheets and pillows and stuff and then like a duvet cover um just because i wanted it to look like more cozy and comfortable um so yeah that's basically what i'm starting with as far as my bedroom so yeah i just wanted to hop on before i get the day started so i went ahead and unboxed everything this is literally all the stuff that was in that corner so just to show y'all kind of the before so this is the bedding the before um yeah i want to just get rid of this comforter and everything and you guys will see i just wanted to kind of show you how it's looking right now um and i haven't done anything in my bedroom literally just brought everything from my old apartment and there's no like artwork or anything above the bed so that's another thing but i at least wanted to do the bedding first um get rid of this comforter it clearly does not go with like a tufted bed <laughs> i can't wait to like swap it out and just have it look like more adult like and more like cozy um so yeah don't get me wrong like i like this comforter but not with this tufted headboard and i kind of wanted to get rid of like the whole mirror thing but i'm not really even worried about that right now plus i think i'm gonna move um so yeah this is just i just kept everything the same in the bedroom and just will work around kind of what i already have y'all so i'm back just gonna do uh well it won't be quick because i kind of got a lot of stuff but just to do a grocery haul before i put everything up so i guess i'll start over here so i picked up some stuff um for my little cousin so i have some stuff that i usually don't get so i just got this cheese pizza i got me some breadcrumbs because i wanted to make some um fried cauliflower so i got some diet cheese um i wanted to make some macaroni and then i also got the mozzarella kinds um for a lasagna then i picked up some more of the um sayete the grain chip the tortilla chips because i want to make some nachos later then i got some waffle fries then i picked up some fill roll sausages so this time i got the italian garlic i think i'm gonna like um crumble this up and use this for my tacos instead of using like beans because i want to kind of give the black beans a break then i got some plant-based uh queso i usually get this one this one actually came from target and then i got some ricotta cheese for the um lasagna and then some shredded lettuce for the tacos some plant-based what is this 
Oh, some plant-based sour cream. Y'all, I really, really like this sour cream. So if you're looking for like a plant-based um, sour cream, I definitely recommend this one. And then I just got some more of my Parmesan cheese, some more of the, what is that? The um, almond milk yogurt. And then I also got some ice cream this time. So I usually get the kind that has like the crunch to it, but they were out. So I just got this kind of the vanilla bean with the coconut milk. And then I usually sometimes get the ice cream sandwiches as well. So these are the 100 calorie ones. And then this one is 140. So I'm just going to get put this in a freezer. All right. And then um, I just got some cereal for my cousin. That's the kind that she loves. And then I got some more avocados. They had a sale. I think it was like uh, five, four, three something, I want to say. And then I got some more of the baby broccoli. Um, some lines for my um, guacamole. And then they were out of the um, cauliflower head. So I just got the kind that already comes cut up, which I prefer because it's less work. So I just got two of these. And then I got some baby spinach, some more of my chickpea noodles, and this time I got the panne pine. Got some more um, olive oil. These, uh, what are they called? Uncrustables <laughs> for my cousin. And then I just got some more of the beans. So when I get beans, if I'm not like making them fresh, I like to get the kind that um, comes in the box. So opposed to like the ones that's in the can so i just got black beans and then the chickpeas so i got two of each i got some more of my instant oatmeal some more uh marinara sauce this is for the lasagna and then what else some uh more of my english muffins for my avocado toast some more almond flour shells and some bananas so yeah that is everything i think yeah that's everything so yeah i'm just about to go ahead and put this up So I'm back in my bedroom so I did go ahead and swap out the sheets and then these right here are all the pillowcases and these are like the velvet material for the three pillows that's going to go in the front um I got this set of three um pillows I think these are what were these these are 22 by 22 and I got these from Pottery Barn and then I have these two sets these are um king size pillows and they are the down alternative and i got these from home goods and then so i went ahead and you know just put the old set over there and then this is actually the duvet cover y'all it's so wrinkled so i'm wondering like will i have to steam it once it's on the bed i guess we'll see and then over here i just have the black throw blanket that i got from target and then this is the actual insert that i got from amazon but you guys know i'll be sure to link it all down in the description box so yeah guys i'm just about to go ahead and try to put the insert inside of the duvet cover i know that it has like the um like the buttons for me to insert the comforter so hopefully it's not too challenging and i think i got I want to say I got like a king size because I wanted it to like fully cover like the bottom. So yeah, that's what I'm about to do. I hope it's not too hard. Know what I got, know what I want. Well, don't 
get me wrong Sure we're having fun But it don't mean that I'm in love I like you a lot But you gotta step up I'm through Trying to tell you what to do How to make me fall for you You should learn that on your own I play cool Cause I hope you pick it up soon And you know just what to do Don't you Boy, just be honest So this is the new bedding um so i still have some work to do but this is how it currently looks um so i do still want to get like a small black pillow to kind of go right in the center um just because that is like the pop of color that i chose just because i already had like the black pieces on the nightstand and then my curtain rod is also black and then with this throw guys it turned out to be much bigger than i thought like i thought it was just a standard black throw but this one can actually cover the whole bed so i'm debating if i want to like get a smaller one or just keep this one since i mean i guess it'll come in handy because i'm not going to want to like get under the duvet cover every night especially like while it's still summertime and really hot so i may just use this as like you know the blanket and then so i won't have to worry about you know steady messing up the sheets um so yeah this is what it currently looks like and then i'm trying to decide like like if I want to get mirrors on the side or if I want to get a piece of artwork above the bed. But I guess I really can't make that decision until I decide what I'm going to do as far as the dressers. Because you guys know, um, I said I was kind of over like the mirror theme. Like those dressers, I actually DIY'd them like years ago. And I just like brung them with me. So yeah, I'm trying to see like what would be the best next you know what would be a good match to go with like that type of tufted bed um but yeah i'm like over the mirrored theme so i'm like i don't know if i should even get mirrors on the side i don't know maybe i can keep it because i mean with the bedding it doesn't look because i just think like with the mirrored it gives you like that glam look and that's not the look i'm going for but i do think the bedding makes it look more like not glam so maybe i can keep them for now um but yeah i guess this was a good start as far as like my bedroom because like i said i haven't done anything so i thought this part would be the easiest so this is how it currently looks and i'll update you guys once i get you know some more stuff so yeah i haven't even started like folding the clothes but then i also got some stuff from target that i need to take out the bags um like paper towel and stuff like that you know doing like the normal restock so this is the stuff that i need to take care of from target like i said it's just the regular like um restock stuff for like the linen closet so i just got some more clorox wipes and i like these kinds as well i usually put these in the bathroom then got some tissue but then over there i also have that stack as well
all right guys so i'm finally done Ooh, that bedding like who knew like the duvet cover would take so long and then the laundry and everything i feel like i just been on my feet all day so yeah i think i'm gonna just end the vlog here be sure to hit the like button if you all enjoyed thank you all for watching and i'll see you next time